Guwahati is the biggest city in the Indian state of Assam and the largest metropolis in northeastern India. It lies along the Brahmaputra River, and is picturesquely situated with an amphitheater of wooded hills to the south. Guwahati is the gateway to the northeast, as it is the major cultural, political, educational, transportation, and commercial hub of northeast India, and is among the fastest developing cities in India. It is known for its rich culture and tradition. Lokpriya Gopinath Bordoloi International Airport, also known as Guwahati International Airport, is the major airport of the city. It is the biggest and busiest international airport in northeastern India. To meet the futuristic demands of Guwahati and add to the infrastructural development of the expanding city, the Airports Authority of India has also undertaken the work for the construction of a new integrated terminal building. The existing approach road to Guwahati Airport is a critical point of concern for both travelers and commuters in the city. The current road leading to the airport is narrow, and with the new upcoming airport terminal, the existing road will be ineffective in handling the increased traffic. To solve this issue PWD, Government of Assam has proposed to widen the roads to six lane and develop well-planned junctions. PWD has identified a stretch of around 7 km with six junctions namely, Dharapur Junction, Garal Junction, Airport Exit and Entry Junction, SOS Junction and VIP Junction, to increase the overall road capacity and ease the flow of traffic. At Dharapur Junction, a grade-separated interchange is proposed that will make the intersection signal-free and help in uninterrupted traffic movement. The traffic coming from Jarlukbari will use the three-lane loop to move toward the airport, and the traffic coming from the airport, towards Golpara will use the other proposed two-lane flyover, and the traffic from the airport, to Jarlukbari will use the three-lane service road. The landscape at the island at the junction has also been designed taking inspiration from the forest setting in the state, with elements like mounds, rocks, and plantations with sculptures depicting modern interpretations of animals. The road from Dawarapur Junction towards Guril Junction will undergo widening. The typical section of the road will have a right-of-way of 45 meters with six-lane carriageway, that measures 10.5 meters on both sides divided by a landscaped green median, providing ample space for vehicular movement. Additionally, there is a 5.5 meters wide serviced, road separated by a 2 meters wide covered drain. Furthermore, a footpath of 1.75 meters alongside the service road is also proposed. For the Guril intersection, it is proposed to transform it into a signal-free junction, by incorporating a roundabout design. The roundabout will cater to the traffic coming from Dharapur toward the airport and Palashpari, and traffic coming from the airport to Dharapur and Palashpari. This strategic development not only enhances traffic flow but also promises significant benefits such as reduced congestion and improved safety. The roundabout will be landscaped to provide an aesthetically pleasing gateway to the area, with a design inspired by the celebration of the famous Bihu dance, on symbolic representation of the rivers of Assam as a fusion of culture with nature. The road from Guril Junction towards SOS Junction will also undergo widening. The typical section of the road will have a right-of-way of 38 meters with six-lane carriageway, that measures 10.5 meters on both sides divided by landscaped green median. Additionally, in this section there is a 5.5 meters wide serviced road on one side, which further increases between airport entry and exit roundabout and is 3.5 meters on other side and are proposed on the covered drains, separated by footpaths of 1.2 meters. For the new airport terminal building, entry, and exit intersections are proposed between Garul and SOS junctions, which will be made signal-free zones with the implementation of roundabouts. The road from the airport entry and exit roundabout will integrate with the elevated departure road of the new terminal, 
whereas a 10 meters wide service road will integrate with the arrival road of the new terminal. The roundabouts will cater to traffic coming from Gurul Junction toward the airport, from SOS Junction to the airport, and from the airport towards SOS and Gurul Junctions. Furthermore, the main arteries leading to and from the airport will undergo expansion. This transformation is expected to yield numerous advantages, including smoother traffic movement, minimized delays, and heightened road safety. The roundabouts will also feature landscape designs that are inspired by the Port Deal, with a wetland and birds theme, enhancing the visual appeal of the airport vicinity. The roundabouts will have a representation of migratory birds as sculptures and water indicating a wetland setting. The SOS junction is also proposed as a signal-free intersection, with a similar intervention of a roundabout. This roundabout will cater to traffic coming from VIP junction to the existing airport and the new terminal building, and from the new airport building and existing airport to VIP junction. The roundabout will be aesthetically designed, with inspiration from the tea plantation of Guwahati. It will contribute to the overall landscape beautification of the SOS roundabout area. The road from the SOS junction, towards the VIP junction, will also undergo widening. The typical section of the road will have a right-of-way of 45 meters with 6-lane carriageway, that measures 10.5 meters on both sides divided by landscaped green median. Additionally, there is a 5.5 meters wide serviced road with a green separator of 1.25 meters. Furthermore, a footpath of 2 meters above the covered drain is also proposed. An oval-shaped roundabout is being proposed at the VIP junction, to make it a signal-free intersection. Road widening of all major arms is also proposed. This junction will ensure uninterrupted movement of traffic coming from the airport towards Jarlukbari and Golpara, and from Golpara and Jarlukbari towards the airport. The landscape at the island at the junction has also been designed with elements like water bodies, bamboo trees, and lighting to make it more aesthetic for the travelers. By making these intersections signal-free with well-designed roundabouts and expanding the major roads, the city is laying the foundation for a more accessible and vibrant urban landscape. These improvements at the intersections will not only address the current traffic issues but will also act as a crucial investment in the future growth and development of Guwahati.